To remove and replace the battery on your Scout, Scout 60, or Scout Bobber, follow these steps. Park the bike on a flat, level surface. And ensure the key is turned off and removed. The seat removal process varies by model. Remove the seat per your owner's manual guidelines. Then press the fuse box release tab inward. Slide the fuse box rearward to remove it from the bracket. Position the fuse box out of the way, using care to prevent damage to the wires. Remove the negative battery cable first to prevent arcing. Position the cable well clear of the terminal. Remove the positive protector boot from the positive battery cable and remove the cable from the terminal. Position the cable well clear of the terminal. Reinstalling the fasteners onto the posts will prevent misplacement. Then remove the battery bracket fastener and remove the bracket. Tilt the battery slightly to the rear and lift it out of the motorcycle. Inspect the battery box for damage. Also, ensure the pads on the bracket are properly located and in good condition. If reinstalling the battery, ensure it is fully charged and free of any debris or damage. Follow the instructions in the battery charging section of your owner's manual before installing the battery. Carefully position the battery into the battery box with the negative terminal toward the front of the motorcycle. Reinstall the battery bracket and torque the specification. Route the positive cable perpendicular to the long side of the battery. Install the positive cable first to prevent arcing. Torque to specification. Reinstall the positive cable protector boot. Then install the negative cable. Route the cable perpendicular to the battery and torque to specification. Apply a light film of dielectric grease or petroleum jelly to both terminals. Verify the cables are secure and properly routed. Carefully reinstall the fuse box to the bracket, ensuring the release tab engages. Turn the bike on to verify the battery has been properly connected. Finally, reinstall the seat per your owner's manual guidelines. For more information, see your authorized Indian motorcycle dealer or visit IndianMotorcycle.com.